friends of Star Thrifter, and I thought we'd go over real quick what sold. And God, thank you, God, thank God, sales picked up because they were really slow, exceptionally slow for about over two weeks. It seems like, and it had some great sales last night and some this morning, more like normal. And um, most all these are on uh, eBay, only one Poshmark. This first one is a. Um, trying to read my writing and I didn't bring my glasses. It's new with tags. Oh, <laughs> sorry. It's new with tags. It's, um, I think it's universal standard. And I was surprised that some of these can go for a little bit of money. It kind of surprised me. Anyhow, um, it sold for $35.55. I ran a 10% off sale and that seemed to maybe be a benefit too, but I went all to God because sales were really slow and I was getting really concerned and they finally picked up. Um, this next one is an East Fifth and it's a 2X and it was a, a pleated long sleeve button and that sold for 20 That kind of surprised me because I've been really dropping the prices on some of that plus size clothing that's not a real great, you know, brand. But that, I, they must have sent an offer or I sent them an offer and they, um, it sold for 20 This was a beautiful blouse. It was ombre pink and um, it was um, by Incorporated and it sold for $18. I really thought maybe it would sell for more than that. It was extremely beautiful, but um, it sold for $18. Um, this next one is a night short sleeve t-shirt, but it's a 1X and I hardly ever sell um, Nike and Adidas and some of those brands because they just sit except for some specific pieces and I've been listing a few lately. Anyhow, I thought with that being a one X, maybe it would sell and it did. It sold for fifteen seventy five. And this next one is Sundance. And if you're not familiar with this, this is part of their, it's called the Before and Again line. If you've watched some of my really old videos, you'll see maybe some of them on the thrift hauls. And they're kind of real thin, almost like a thermal, but it, real thin. But it just says um, Before and Again on it. It doesn't say Sundance, but it's part of the Sundance line. And that's sold for 25 Some of them can sell for 30 and 35 just depending on what you have. Um, this next one is a Calvin Klein black dress, and I just listed this. However, it's a size 14, and that was a big benefit because some of the smaller size Calvin Klein dresses are sitting. But this was a really cool looking dress. It was black, and it had like a floral on the undercuff and a little bit around the waist. That might have been on one of the recent thrift haul videos. This is a Catherine's, and it's just a short sleeve T3X, and that sold for $15.90. That brand, I used to always hear, oh, yeah, it was great or whatever. Well, I found that it really sat. However, I guess you just have to kind of, like, have some other features about it that makes it more sellable. Now, this was just a T-shirt, but it I was happy it sold for that. Um, this I've had for a really long time. I think this is probably a really old inventory, and it's a Talbot's long sleeve blouse and it's floral and it sold for ten dollars i just wanted to uh, sell it because i've been pulling a lot of the um the talbots and the chicos if they've been sitting for a really long time i've been pulling them and just redonating them unless they're plus size for the talbots or something really spectacular but I'm, i guess i just didn't come across that yet or it could be because it seemed like this piece always had quite a little bit of interest on it this next one is a Chaps No Ironed, and I find with the plus sizes, they do sell, and this is a plus size 2X floral, and it sold for 21. You should be 20, 25. Sometimes you might get more if it's something really maybe spectacular, or it depends on how long you want to hold out to sell it. This next one is a Lane Fisher piece, and it was just a pullover. Uh, top, petite, large, I guess, and it's over 20. I was happy to get that. This is the Poshmark sale. This was a Dana Butman uh, leather skirt. I'd had it listed for a really long time, and I think I sent out an offer at 20, and they took it. I was happy just to, uh, you know, get it sold or whatever. But write in the comments how your sales have been going, and if you'd like, you can subscribe and you can check out some of the other uh, videos, you know, what sold videos or haul videos, or I have um, 
you know, some on, you know, like how much sold for the week, things like that. And if you could push the thumbs up button, I'd greatly appreciate that too. Many prosperous sales to you. Thank you.